So I'm going to show you really quickly how to duplicate a pattern easily on your screen. Um, thanks so much to Wendy for showing us this cool feature. And this is simple to do. Um, fill patterns are great when you want to fill a shape all the way with a pattern. So the first thing I'm going to do, I already have a uh, pattern on my computer. I was using the quarter full pattern to test this out. So I just screenshotted this from Google Images. I just screen, I just Googled a quarter full pattern, picked one that looked good, and did a screenshot. So I'm not quite sure how to do that on a PC. It's very simple to do on a Mac using Command Shift 4, and you'll get some little crosshairs pop up that you can just take a quick grab of what you want to screenshot. So then I'm going to come back to my software, my Silhouette Studio software. I don't have DE, I just have the basic version. And I'm going to just click and drag that onto my screen. So that's just a JPEG. It's not a cuttable file or anything. So if you click once, your measurements pop up. And if you double click, you're going to see these four gray squares pull up on your screen. And so this is really awesome. I didn't know this, but all you have to do is click and drag. And that pulls that shape as big as you need it. Simple. So this is really perfect for tracing. If you didn't want to lose your pattern or didn't want it to be distorted, then that's what this would do for. So if I just traced it, um, I always uncheck my high pass filter and just to see if it's any better. It's not, which is fine. So if I bring that high pass up, I get a really nice clean trace on that. And I like to put it in a color just so I can make sure that it cleaned up nicely on my trace. And it did. So then, of course, you can do whatever you want with that. Um, if you wanted to draw a shape, you could very easily uh, make a quarter full circle or just whatever you wanted to do. There it is. Looks great. Thanks, Wendy, for showing us this tip.